Welcome to Rock Week Ukulele. And instead of learning a chord this time, we're going to learn how to read ukulele tab. Now, once you've learned how to do this, it's really easy. Um, but to start with, it does take quite a lot of brain power. So really quickly, let's just run through the ukulele strings again. So we've got G on top, then C, then E, then A. Good children eat apples, to help you remember it, G-C-E-A. And when we look at ukulele tab, it's kind of upside down when you look at it on a screen. So the top string, the G string, is on the bottom of where you're looking, and then it keeps working its way up. So G, C, E, A. Now, when you've got printed ukulele music like I do here and you have it in front of you, the further string away on the paper is the further string away from you. So the top string's closest and furthest string away is furthest away. So it makes a bit more sense if you can have it printed in front of you. What else do you need to know? So there's different numbers that appear on the different strings. So for example, if we look at the C string, if there was a zero, that's an open string, so you just play an open string. If there was a one, you would put a finger in the first section, two, second section, three, and so on, all the way up. So if we were to take a simple pattern, uh, so have a look at this pattern. We've got one on C, there it is, then three on C, and then five on E. You would play one, section one, on the C string, then section three, on the C string, and section five, on the E string. So that's kind of the overview of how it works. There's going to be some videos now where I'm going to teach you some different songs using these tabs.